Welcome. We do appreciate that caring for a pick line can be a daunting task. Remember, you are not alone. You have this video to follow, and if needed, you can contact the Oncology Day Unit. To start with, make sure you are both comfortable with enough space and a surface to work from. Wash your hands. Remove the outer fabric cover. Wipe the working surface with an antibacterial wipe, spray or soap and water. This area is ideally a tray that is just used for pick care only. Ensure that it is allowed to air dry. Gather your equipment, dressing pack, sterile gloves, these are in the dressing pack, pre-filled syringes, one for a single lumen, one tube, two for a dual lumen, two tubes, chloroprep sponge, three mil, Pick dressing. Clinel wipes. Vigon bungs. Line cover. To be fast or something purchased. Prepare your equipment by dropping it onto your clean surface. Start with the dressing pack, this will give you a lining for the tray. The dressing pack contains an apron, gloves, a blue sheet, a rubbish bag, and a hand towel. Continue to open and drop the other equipment onto the tray, ensuring that you do not touch anything in the packets. Check you have everything you need. Wash your hands. Carefully pick up the apron from the tray and put it on. Now place the blue sheet under the arm with the pick line. You are now ready to start the dressing change and flush. Very gently remove the dressing. Start by slowly lifting the edges. The dressing might be sticky, but very gently pull back and support the skin underneath as shown. Continue doing this until the dressing is released. Wash your hands and dry them thoroughly with the paper towel found in the dressing pack.
put on the gloves from the dressing pack. The secure cath is now visible and the pick exposed. This is securing the pick line and remains in place. The secure cath is securing the pick line and preventing it from moving. Using the chloroprep sponge, squeeze the arms to release the cleaning solution. Lift the line and secure cath and clean as shown. Remember to clean under the secure cath and around the entry point of the pick line. Drop the chloroprep sponge away from the dressing tray. Allow the area to air dry to avoid skin irritation. Take the backing off the dressing with the adhesive side facing the skin. Lower the dressing over the pick covering the entry point, secure cath and the white T-shaped part. Gently massage the dressing, this ensures it adheres to the skin. We do not want to stretch the dressing, as this can pull the skin and be very uncomfortable. You have now completed the dressing change. In your tray, you will have a Vigon bung. This is also changed weekly. With the Kleinel wipe, clean the end of the pick as shown and remove the bung. Clean the area exposed once the bung is removed and allow it to air dry. Gently pull the plunger down to allow you a clear view of the air in the syringe. Then gently push your plunger until you have a small bubble at the tip. You are now ready to flush your pick line. Attach the pre-filled syringe using a twisting motion. Proceed to flush the line with the push-pause technique as demonstrated. Remember the last mill is a push, twist and pull technique. This locks the line. The new bung can now be attached to the pick line. Remove your gloves. Write and attach the date of dressing change onto the dressing. If you have had some reactions to the standard dressings used, you may be supplied with a sensitive dressing.
Cover the pick line with 2B Fast or a purchased fabric cover. Ensure that the line is secured under the cover. Your pick line dressing and flush is now complete. Use the bag to dispose of the used items. This can be placed in your domestic bin. Wash your hands.